I've been a rideshare driver for nearly five years, um, and today I'm going to share with you the best rideshare driving related purchase I've made to date. Now, as far as importance of things that I've purchased for rideshare driving, of course, my car would be number one on that list, then probably my phone, and there's some other items I've purchased for rideshare driving too, like my dash cam, my phone mount, my charging. Um, charging adapter, um, a lint roller, uh, the, a duster. But the best thing that I personally purchased for rideshare driving is at its core a non-essential item. Um, I actually didn't have one of these for my first two years of rideshare driving, um, but over the last three years of rideshare driving I've had it and it's become absolutely essential and it's cheap. I purchased it for $20 on Amazon. And it's my Bluetooth earpiece. Um, the one I own is an MPOW EM1 Bluetooth earpiece that I purchased on Amazon for, again, $20. And there are many times where I forget that it's even in my ear. It's that lightweight. Um, I can't re recommend this one in particular enough. All right, and the main reason it has become essential to my rideshare driving experience is because I use it to listen to podcasts when I'm giving someone a ride. Um, it just makes driving much more enjoyable and helps to pass the time. Now, if I were to guess, um, I'd say about 80% of my passengers prefer to just look at their phone or not talk at all. And the times where I, where I didn't have a Bluetooth earpiece and I would give rides, um, it would make those long trips or days become pretty monotonous. Sure, we can listen to music over my car speakers, but I personally prefer to listen to talk radio and podcasts and not everyone probably wants to listen to the talk radio or podcasts that I listen to, so I don't wanna to have to force my passengers to listen to that over my car speakers, so the Bluetooth earpiece is a great solution for that. And again, I personally enjoy podcasts, um, mainly because for the most part they're commercial free, but you could also choose to listen to internet radio, uh, maybe music if you wanna to listen to some music, or even an, uh, an audiobook. And also having the earpiece in is great for um, on those off chances where you do need to make a call to the passenger. Now as far as using the earpiece, I don't go into every ride with the assumption that I'm going to. Um, I, I will ask my passengers the, the typical questions that I ask, and if they do want to engage, that conversation takes priority. Um, but if, say, they're looking at their phone or they don't want to engage, they're not talkative, again, this is about eight in every 10 passengers, um, in the earpiece stays and I'll listen to a podcast. And I personally don't want the passenger to see the earpiece. Um, that's why I, I bought the skin tone color, it's small, I keep it in my left ear. I just feel like this is the best way in, um, that by using it, it won't affect my ratings. And again, as far as content, I personally prefer to listen to podcasts because of their commercial free nature. Um, I, I subscribe to a few local and national sports podcasts. And of course, I'm subscribed to the Rideshare Guy podcast. In a given week, I probably listen to 10 plus hours of content while driving Rideshare. It's just a great way to take advantage of your time driving um, by staying current on events or sports, um, maybe listening to an audiobook, or you could even learn a new language. Again, I've now used the Bluetooth earpiece for three years of my Rideshare driving experience. It has become absolutely essential um, there are some days where I'll put in 10, 11 hour days, long days, and those days can become really monotonous and having that earpiece helps to pass the time and just makes driving much more enjoyable. So that's personally my best rideshare related purchase, um, but what is yours? How much did it cost you? Uh, leave a comment below and let us know. Um, if you haven't subscribed to the Rideshare Guy channel, please subscribe. We post new videos every single week. Thanks again for watching and drive safe. Thanks.